everybody, my name is Nicole Chocolate, and today, I am in a damp hole. You may be wondering where I am, and I'll get to that in just a second. Sorry I haven't recorded for a while, I've had some problems with my recording software, and I've been sick for a little while. You don't want to hear my problems, so let's get out of this hole. around here all right everyone so I have um, I've gathered materials and I'm in another hole the reason is there was a tree that ha uh, or a creeper that has climbed a tree and has become too advanced for me to fight so I'm hiding here also because there's phantoms yeah, that's not good. Um, I got a little materials, and I'm just, you know, going about waiting for the night to pass and the phantoms to burn. Am I safe? I don't think so. Anyway, while I'm in this hole, I'm gonna... T oh, okay, is my face upside down? <laughs> no, I'm just in my face. Alright, there we go. While I'm here, I'm just going to take the time to stop and talk to you about some of the rules and things on this server. And yeah, and so basically, this server is going to get chaotic. There is griefing allowed, there is fire spreads on, keep inventory off, and stealing, and griefing, and explosions, and all that dangerous mayhem stuff is on. So, it might get a little crazy sometimes. There's prank wars gonna happen, and steal the thing, just suffocate it in a wall, stuff like that. I don't know if I explained this already, but, um, steal the stain without the two is um, the person who runs the server is just an AFK character that stands there so whoever's friends with him can join. Steal the Stain 2 is the person who actually plays on the server, and that is who just suffocated in a wall. And yeah, there's more people going to be joining the server shortly, but right now it's just me and Steal the Stain. Um. See you, see you when I get out of the soul. I also don't know if I've um, told you that the reason my mic sounds completely awful is, yeah, as I said earlier, I had some software and microphone issues with my mic and audio and all that. Hopefully a better quality, much better quality sound of my voice, I don't know, I don't know, is coming soon. Anyways, I'll meet you at his hole. So I've got myself some better tools and made the hole I was waiting in a bit bigger. I think I've been waiting in this hole for years. Oh, it's finally dawn. Yes. Alright, now we can really embark on our journey and see where we're going to just settle in the meanwhile. Not forever, obviously. I don't know quite where to build my base yet, or even really what to build, but oh, I lost my boat. Where'd my boat go? It's around here somewhere. Ah, uh, I need to find my boat. Be right back. I've found my boat, but there seems to be a drowned that has claimed it. Ah, four sparks. Okay, well, he's in my boat now, and I don't want to die, which I probably am. 
Okay, well, bye bye. You know, he, you know, he can have my boat. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. I can, I can jump. I can always just make a new one. So I finally got myself a new boat. And um, yeah, I don't know why I haven't put it on the water yet. Probably because I was eating, and I might die soon. But you know, it's okay. Uh, away. Is that a mushroom island? Or is it just not loaded in yet? I have a feeling it's just not loaded in yet. Um, if it was a mycelium island, I would have been very happy, but it's not. It's just, it's just not loaded in yet. But this is a dark oak forest, which could provide some nice shelter. Okay, there's two creepers. They've cloned themselves. First, they were flying into trees and climbing trees. Now they've discovered how they can clone themselves. They're too advanced for us now. Alright, so I've finally reached shore. Give me my boat. Alright, so I've reached shore. Now to see what monsters await us in this great force. I could probably just make my starter base right here and just live off that for a little while. Ooh, that giant mushroom seems like the perfect location to have a starter base. I should probably eat. I don't have a lot to eat, but you know, something is better than nothing. I haven't came across I was about to say too many non-hostile animals on my way here, but, you know, again, something is better than nothing. Alright, so this place looks like a good location here. I think I'm going to make like some ladders up there and make like a base emerged into the tree, half in the mushroom as well. And yeah, maybe we can even have like a deck over here on this mushroom. Should be pretty cool for a tiny starter base. I mean, it's obviously not gonna be too big, but let's get, let's get started. as much as I got. Time to go punch some more wood. Or not punch, since we have a super high-tech, uh, state-of-the-art axe right here. Don't worry guys, I'm not leaving any trees floating. I'm not a monster. Look at look at me. I'm, I'm not a monster, alright? You know, I don't really care if anyone blows up my base, destroys it. You know, it's all in good fun. But leaving f trees floating, that is the true monstrosity. The true horror. Anyway. The next thing we need is for the creeper to come and invade us in our dreams. Then they'll be the most high tech, high tech species in the Minecraft world. Able to come in any reality and universe. 
Also, my axe is going to break. As well as my bones. Is that the last of the wood? I think so. The tree has started to grow. And my axe is gone. Time to take down this monstrosity. go check it out at the end of the episode. Well, I'll see you when we got the rest of the ladder done. Alright, so I got my little mushroom tiny place house thing done. Now, I just need to wait till the morning to go out there, and then I need to go mining because I need coal for torches, for lighting, I need iron for shears. So I can build my way out into the tree and make a little deck. But for now, I think I'm just going to rest in here for a little bit. See you in the morning. So I removed the, the center stem pole in the middle of this because I thought it was a little bit intrusive. And, and now it looks a lot more open. So I think I'm just going to make like a little lounger and just sit down <laughs> or something. I'm just going to sit down on this nice chair. Just, uh, you know, I can put a little arm on it. Just like a little arm and just, you know, just, I'll just rest until, until, oh, wait, did I hear a zombie die? Did the zombie that was chasing me die also? What's that? Okay, no, it did not. I'm just gonna, yeah, as I was saying, I'm just gonna rest here. What is killing that zombie? Yeah, I don't really want to find out. Anyway, I'm just, as I was saying, for like the third time, I'm just gonna rest here and um, wait for um, yeah, morning to come. Also, again, I really, really, really apologize for the terrible sound and quality of my microphone. Like, I don't even know if you can tell what I'm saying. But I'm, I'm sure, I'm, I promise, hopefully, it will get better soon. Mm. Not in this video, hopefully the next. Yeah. When's morning coming? I'm bored. Just so it's not so dark, I'm gonna put some fences or fence gates. I guess fences it is, and you can craft them. Place it on the end. Is it dawn? Oh, it's raining. I'm gonna have to risk it. Risk it for the biscuit. Ah! Oh, wow. That wasn't that hard. No baddies can get in there while I'm gone. I'm gonna go kill some things, get some, um, yeah, some meat, so I don't starve to death. Then I'm gonna hop into that mine and see if I can get some materials. Is that a cow? I need some leather. Oh, and then I'll wait for the other one to grow up and then I'll kill it. I'm not cruel, I'm just hungry. I hear some baddies, so 
so you know what? I think I'm gonna go to the other one instead. I know more food. Don't worry, I'm not gonna get them because I'm not that easy. Okay, well that's a deep pit and a sure death if I fall in there. Okay, and I was about to say so, so I'm not that deep. Alright, I'm gonna carefully dig my way down. There's like no resource. Oh, I was about to say there's no resources, but here we go. There's some iron. I'm guessing I need a stone pickaxe. Is there any coal? Coal, yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo! Coal anywhere? Oh look, some more cows. No! Technically what I really need is sheep, but you know, cows... Get them no. leather, leather. Get that good leather, and I can armor myself up. No! Now, hopefully, 
hopefully I should be able to, what was I trying to do again? Oh yeah, so I got a bed now, so I can finally set my spawn point. Actually, I can cook the beef. I'm gonna see if I can craft some armor with the leather I just got from killing all those cows. Alright. Right. I think we got a pretty good starter base today. So with that, this has been the Bull Chocolate. If you had any questions or anything about the server or anything, ask them in the comments below. And with that, this has been the Bull Chocolate. Goodbye, y'all.